Alrighty then, Dalek. Where should we be off to today? Let's see, our choices are your home planet, Skaro, the Earth's moon, the scary nether, or the overworld. What do you think? You don't say much, do you? Hello everyone, Doe Killer here, and welcome to another random Minecraft video. So today I am again coming to you from Minecraft 1.8 and the Dalek mod, and I am with my new companion, the pink fluffy Dalek. And so today we are going to show you how you can make your own Dalek companions using the Dalek mod in Minecraft 1.8. And you can do this with one easy command. So let me just rematerialize and then we can step outside and I can show you how you can do this. There we go. So if we just step out here, we can get out a command block, you know, in creative mode. And the command that we're going to be using is the entity data command, like in the last video. So we're going to set that up. We're going to set the type equal to the DM dollop base. And then open and close some curly brackets and leave them blank for now. Now you can take a dollop of your choice and spawn it in. And then power this command block. Now the reason we did this is because it'll put the this Dalek's entire NBT structure in the output here. Now we don't need the whole thing, but we do need one thing from it. And that is the attributes tag. So it's towards the beginning, right here. So you're going to want to highlight this. And the reason we're highlighting it is because you can type this out, but it's kind of hard to do so and it's a pretty long tag. So I found it's easiest just to copy and paste this. So attributes contain slangs like the Dalek's generic max health, its follow range, its movement speed. Here's some of the basic characteristics of the Dalek that it has. So highlight the entire thing, it'll end with a square bracket just after generic dot attack damage, and it's just before the invulnerable tag. So you can control or command C to copy that, and then paste it between those curly brackets up in the top. So now where it says generic dot attack damage at the very end, obviously this is the amount of damage that Dalek does when he hits you with his laser, you're going to change that to zero. 0.0D. 0. 0 and then the next one down is generic dot follow range, the distance the Dalek has to be away from you before he starts chasing you down and trying to exterminate you. It's set at 16.0D, you're going to want to change that to 0.0D. 0. 0D. And that is it. That's all you have to do. So hit enter. And then we can make this guy tame. But first, I'm going to go in survival mode and demonstrate that this guy is deadly. So now he's chasing me, and he's going to fire a laser off at me. If I get close enough. I'm... So there we go. So now let me get far enough away so I can get the creative motor in. Alrighty. Let's get him back by the command block. And then when we power the command block, now once again when you go in survival mode, he's not going to try to kill us. So there you go. That is how you can get a tame Dalek companion in one easy command. So another thing I want to say is that you can also use this with the summon command. And you can directly summon in a Dalek. You don't have to use an existing one with entity data. You can summon in the Dalek. And after you put in the coordinates, you can paste in that attributes tag and do exactly what we did and then you can summon the Dalek in. And so another thing I want to bring up is that this entity data tag, it doesn't naturally, it affects all entities. So what we just did does not only work with Daleks, it will work with every single mob in the Dalek mod, and every mob in any other mod, and with vanilla Minecraft mobs. So we can just use the summon command for that as well. So if we just take this and say change it to an Auton for instance, and then I'll change the ID here. That will summon in an Auton. If I go back in survival mode, he is tame as well. So as I said, any single mob this will work for, any hostile mob. And a little bit of a heads up with the creeper, I haven't tried it, but I believe if you do this with the creeper and you get real close to him, he will still blow up. 
So you want to be extremely cautious with creepers. But other than that, guys, that is how you can make your own tame Dalek friends. So I will see you all in the next video. And until then, goodbye.